In this video, you will be learning how to get root access on Kali Linux. It's very easy, but let me show you. So at first, why we need root user? So let me open the terminal. We like terminal. Okay, we like CLI. So in the terminal, if I want to do a simple thing like maybe apt update. Okay, I want to update the system enter Kali Linux. Okay, and hit enter. It's showing permission denied because i am not a root user i am not an administrator so it's error in there so if i want to do this thing if i want to run this command i have to do sudo then apt update and if i hit enter it will ask me my password and the password is like you know before that it was like kali kali it was like a default password but in 2025, the new Kali Linux OS, you have to set a password when you are installing this system in your virtual machine or computer. Okay, the last video I already told you how to install a Kali Linux in your virtual machine or VMware. Okay, it's very easy. So in there, I show you the step how to set the password. It's by default you can set anything, whatever the things you want. So for me, I set one, two, three, four, and of course in the terminal, the password is not showing. It will be not it will not okay hit enter and now you start let me just stop it okay so you know every time i want to do this type of activity this type of administrative command i want to run it in my system i have to like do this uh, pseudo thing again and again and again and this is very very boring thing okay it's, it was very boring so what i can do i can just like you know log in as a pseudo user okay or root user whatever the things you can call it you want to call it i don't know okay so how to log in as a sudo user or root user i can do a sudo and then su hit enter and it will ask me my password the password is one two three four and hit enter and it will log in as a root user you can check the who am i command and it show i'm now in root so here i can just directly do apt update hit enter and it will start the process okay let me stop it again yeah. every time i must stop it, maybe there will be a lot of problem but it's okay so but uh, uh, if i want to change the password of this user i will type the command psw double s double t okay then you can set the new password thing okay a new password can be anything the last time it was one two three four now i am trying one two three four five it's not showing hit enter then one two three four five new password hit enter and the password updated successfully okay the very simple step and subscribe for more see you in the next video